Hello Pisces, I'm ready to do your April reading. So whatever it is that you need to know for your highest good that's coming towards you and how to best deal with it. Also, we're going to ask about your soulmate, whoever it is that you're thinking of while watching this video. No matter what sign you, they are or gender they are, uh, whether you're currently in touch with them or not, we're going to ask how they're doing, what's going on with them in their life, what's coming towards them that you should be aware of for your highest good, and how they are currently feeling towards you. Um, yeah. So, first, let's see how you're doing, Pisces. This is going to extend for a lot of you beyond April uh, and begin today, which is March 24th. Universe, please step in, show very clear. Let me adjust the camera. Very clear and important messages collectively for the sign of Pisces, please. For Pisces, highest good. Universe, what is coming towards Pisces? What will Pisces be dealing with? Two of Cups. So you're going to be celebrating or happy about something in your life, uh, love, uh, either somebody is interested in you or uh, something happy and joyous happening in your life. Eight of Swords, uh, you're scared, a lot of you are scared, Pisces, of uh, relationship at this time. Yeah, you're trying to balance your energy. So there is somebody that you like, that you care about, and is obviously interested in you, but you are very reserved. you showing up as scared, not balanced, very reserved. It's somebody that you know already. You, you know from this life, you've met them before, and you know them from past lifetimes. So it's one of your soulmates. Remember, we live many lifetimes, so we have many soulmates. Some are dysfunctional and toxic, depending on what it is they're supposed to learn each, each life, and some are higher vibration. Wow, look at this. Two of Cups clarified by Two of Cups from another deck. So there's some something happy, uh, some something very joyous coming into your life. Uh, entering your life either this month or will be next month um this is major arcana of two of cups the archangel is holding two of cups temperance some of you are dealing with um sagittarius seven of wands with two of pentacles so you feel unbalanced financially um you feel uh, worried about your finances six of pentacles so this shows here that whoever it is that's interested in you and you know them you you care for them also shows here that they are willing to work and put work into this connection this relationship with you so it's not somebody that's selfish or looking for one night stand it's somebody who is interested in a committed relationship long term let's see more clarification universe for Pisces yeah so it's like your heart is ready for a new beginning but your mind is over analyzing and scared and worried and reserved but your heart is ready you have a lot of passion so it's somebody that has a lot of passion for you and love for you uh it shows you're going to be okay financially so you worried about your finances um some chaos going on around you a lot of chaos but you're going to be fine this is victory card chariot also representing the sign of cancer so you may be dealing with sagittarius cancer and Scorpio showing up very clearly. Major transformation coming to your life with this death card for the better. It's divinely ordered. It's a major arcana. It's a life force card. Whenever death shows up, it means you can't avoid the change. It's ordered by the universe. 
major change coming to your life for the better it's the death is good death is necessary for rebirth regeneration new beginning wow some good stuff coming to you you worried though about finances hmm huh. you worried about you worried about things that go on around you that are very stressful so here it is seven of swords with some fake people misinformation uh, people fighting arguing you worried about the future eight of swords seven of swords five of swords seven of wands two of pentacles something to do with money so you worrying a lot of people showing up here as fighting uh disagreeing uh whatever it is that's going on do not let people drag you into their negative energy negative way of thinking okay try to stay positive away from energy vampires who are trying to make you panic just because they are panicking uh, be wise do not join groups do not follow people when they are crazy and panicking okay uh, don't fall into that trap of negativity okay think for yourself universe please step in show the soulmate whoever it is you're thinking of that showed up as two of cups towards you from two different decks and obviously you are uh, caring for them as well let's see universe how is the soulmate of pisces that showed up as two of cups <coughs> and six of cups just now how is the soulmate of pisces doing what's happening in their life what is happening in soulmate's life what are they facing and how is the soulmate of pisces relating to pisces at this time uh this is leap of faith very good energy new beginning so this person is looking for new beginnings in their life new chapter something new something refreshing something exciting they want to have faith in relationships they want to have trust in relationships yeah so you know this person from other lifetimes justice card um libra energy some of you may be dealing with the libra so <laughs> they scared as much as you are uh so they feel this intense connection with you and i think it scares them yeah they know that they have feelings for you here it is again two of cups so they know that have they have these deep feelings for you but they holding back they scared to show their feelings they may be hiding them on purpose because they scared of the unknown they scared of things going wrong going sour going south let's do clarification universe how is the soulmate of pisces doing what is the soulmate of pisces dealing with and how are they relating to pisces at this time so this person is uh thinking of offering you something romantic something emotional knight of cups emotional gesture a date something very emotional warm beautiful they have a lot of respect for you so this person sees you as an empress uh, they see you as somebody who has self-respect integrity uh, is picky who has self-love class this person wants to unite with you for some of you this person is from your past whether you were ever involved with them or not in this lifetime it shows that they want to be a part of your life also reconciliation with the judgment card nine of cups so their wish is to be with you in a romantic relationship that's their wish uh, they wish to tell you and show you how they feel about you but they scared they holding back they scared mm -hmm. they they are very guarded they don't want to show too much too fast 
So this is weighing heavily on them emotionally not to be able to show you how much they are interested in you. Uh, this person wants to take action towards you. They're showing up here as king of wands, which means they want to take action towards you. This also means they are uh, attractive, uh, charismatic, admired by other people, successful. Yeah, they see you as marriage material. So it's somebody who has been observing you for a while, sees you as an empress and hierophant, which means they would like to uh, have a long-term relationship with you. The moon card, they're scared of the unknown. They're not sure what's going to happen. Some of you may be dealing with another Pisces, also Cancer energy, Taurus energy, Taurus energy. And... Uh, Libra energy this person wants to do right by you uh, they want to be just towards you uh, this person is not looking for one night stand two night stand three night stand they're not looking for mind games this person is responsible reliable independent also they are the type of person that doesn't need somebody to complete them but nevertheless they would like to have somebody that's classy that's uh, a whole person, a good person. So they want to share their life with somebody that's worthy of their energy, of their time. Uh, they are a little scared of what's going to happen. Nevertheless, they're very excited. And let me see more. More. Anything else? Hermit. So some of you may be dealing with a Virgo. If it's not a Virgo, it could be any sign whatsoever. It means they're going within, analyzing, assessing the situation, uh, trying to figure out the best uh, plan of action. Wow. Look at this. So you guys have a soul contract. You meant for a reason in this lifetime. But remember, what happens... In this relationship with the two of you going forward will depend on your free uh, uh, free will actions and their free will actions but the two of you agreed to meet this is a faded meeting you were supposed to meet this person this person loves you but is not telling you ace of cups this person is not telling you they love you they scared so and so are you look at this eight of swords from two different decks they are over analyzing they worrying excessively they're not listening to their intuition when they worry too much they worrying of screwing up of saying something wrong or doing something wrong they don't want to mess this up uh they holding back from telling you how much you mean to them emotionally this also shows uh romantic relationships from past lives with you uh, let's see more. What else is going on with the soulmate of Pisces? Universe, what else is going on in the soulmate's life that Pisces is allowed to see? So once again, they want you in their life. Nine of Cups, wish fulfillment. Yeah, they see you as independent, not needing anybody. Good provider, good with finances, good with work, good with business, beautiful, attractive. Yeah, very good. The tower, what's up with that? They miss you when they don't see you, when they don't interact with you, when they don't, don't talk to you. They miss you. It shocks them. Um, they, I don't think they fully understand it because it's a soul connection two of pentacles so they feel unbalanced something happened in their life that shook them up uh, to their core something that's involving a lot of people around them and it has to do with finances so they worried about finances this person loves you again two of cups so you are their wish you see something to do with finances here's pentacles Something is going on that's affecting their finances and people around them. Yeah. This also means that they tried to release you in the past, but they are unable. They keep thinking about you. They want to see you. They want to talk to you. They want to interact with you. 
they see you as beautiful attractive independent powerful popular charismatic so this person has solid intentions towards you uh, they see you as marriage material so they are a provider type they are a type that so obviously a lot of you are females watching this and you are dealing with the men because king is a very masculine energy so this king of pentacles they showing that in a love reading their intention is marriage long-term commitment uh, uh, engagement living together under the same roof uh, they are a good provider yeah again nine of cups from two different decks so this person their wish is to live with you be with you under the same roof this also means something happened uh the tower card uh that's affecting a lot of people around them and people are worried about finances this is all money pentacles 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 money 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 so people are worried about their financial stability moving forward in life yeah money again this person also is very worried about their financial future this also shows another thing when they don't see you when they not around you when they not in contact with you they miss you yeah so there is a very profound soul connection between you pisces and this individual so we're going to go into the extended reading we're going to ask uh, at the current time, what your soulmate's true long-term plans and intentions are for you. We're going to ask anything they may have up their sleeve at the moment uh, that they're hiding, but the universe feels you should be aware of at this time for your highest good, of course. And based on the energies that show up during the reading at the very end, we're going to ask for advice for you from the universe, from spirit on how to best handle this connection this relationship with this individual and anything else that you need to know any other messages that pop up that the universe feels you should be aware of and your best course of action in the situation so click on the extended link below this video in the description box below and i'll see you there thank you so much pisces